Well, I'm Ranger Cookie, and this property is for sale. So we're gonna take a little. A little adventure in the ghost house. We have about an hour left of light, so we have to do a little rush. That'd be kind of cool if a bunch of fellas get together and make an estate for bushcrafters to come out here just to do bushcrafting stuff. This property goes to the Bay Lacombe area. All this right now is all one big piece of property. You don't have to put no lights on this property. If you're gonna use it, nothing but bushcrafting and so forth. You can see this place on Google Earth. It's pretty, pretty big, I tell you that. It's a monster place. Looks like it's really swampy too. So we're gonna take a look, see what it's all about. This row has been used very recently. Don't know how long ago, we could find out by the water, see if it's stirred up. Nope, it's been a while. See, there's no, no gray in it. So it's been a while since anybody used the road for anything. I will find out. I'll show you the sign for this place. Then, if you're not using it for bushcrafting, you can use it for paintball field. It'd be a big paintball field. Look at how pretty that is. Look at that. Snuggert. There's some tracks right there. They're pretty old. Yeah, that, that track's pretty old. That'd be kind of cool. We uh, 
a bunch of uh, bushcrafters buy this property and use it as a, uh, a school. It'd be a nice place to do it too. It has a bayou, has a few kind of marshy. Oh, that's like water right there. Coming out here at middle of the night is different from during the day. At least during the day you can see a little bit more. We don't have any barn owls in here. Bunch of things you could do in there. It'd be really pretty cool if we can use this, or somebody bought this place and use it as a uh, like a training school place. Let's we'll see if we can find the bayou. The bayou should be back behind this house here. Then again, if I remember right, there's another house. It should be this one and another one back there. So we're gonna take a look. It'd be also a good hunting ground during certain seasons. And we're coming to the ghostly mansion. It's a shame that people allow a place like this to go to shit. You should pass a law that if you abandon the place, somebody can take over it with no hassle because you abandoned it. Hours in your face. Bathroom. <laughs> Shower come down on your face. We got a fire pit.
This used to be a beautiful home. Medieval mansion. Like hot water here. Look at that door. It shows you how old it is. Check the bees. Oh, look at this. What a beautiful place. It's just let down for ruins. It's sad. It's very sad. Look, hey, must be a pool nearby. It's like a little patio. This is a patio. Yeah, let's hit the pools back there. <sighs> A lot of waste the kitchen. Please. Should we tread upstairs? Let's do it. Try not to walk in any black space. See that? I mean, that's going to be rotten. that old jukebox A shame Yeah, they should pass a law. Any homes or houses that has been abandoned can be retaken by somebody else. If you cannot upkeep it, This is, this is where I will go for my bug out home. This is way much better. It's much solider, solider, much solid. It's nice and warm up here. Take a look at that. Look at 
these old door frames, these old doors. That's really close. See this? That means that's gonna be ruined too, so can't walk in that area while dying. That's a definitely a no-no. Can't go no further. Time to get out of here. I just wanted to show you another little area. This would be a better place to uh, bug out to. Plus, this property is for sale. So, that'd be kind of cool if we can, uh, if a bunch of people get together and bought this property. And made it a uh, what you call it a good survival school place that'd be kind of cool I'll show you the sign when we get out it's a shame all right if I'm not mistaken there should be another house out here a red one Oh shit, it's like a hunter's field. I don't want to be trapped in a hunter's field when I heard some shooting earlier. Oh, there's the bayou. Can you see it? Oh, the net. There's the bayou. Let's see if we can find another spot with the bayou. A pile of bricks. Nice, beautiful tree there. And this is where I heard the fire in that. So. There's the bayou. Look at that. Little bitty bayou. We way up in Bayou Lacombe. Huh. Looks like you had something here. Maybe a boat launch or something.
Looks like there's a bayou right there too. Boy, it's so clear. I'm scared it might be a hunter's den. Oh look, it's like the bayou or big ditch. Let's take a look. Oh nope, it's a it's a swallow with a trail. Or it could be the bayou. That is Bayou Lacombe or Swallow. Big area where water stands. Yeah, that's that's where water stands. There could be a little runoff to that area. Look at that scary tree. Let's see if I can find that bayou. That's what I want. Bayou. Okay, it looks like you went way out. Look how pretty that is. right there Me and my friend Andrew, we row, we paddle our boats up, upstream to go to summer camp, which is across the interstate. The interstate's like that way. All right, I'm going to show you the way out of here and show you the sign in case you fellers like to all get together and buy a piece of property to do bushcrafting stuff tear that old house down right, there's the bayou again and there's a boat launch for, for boats I thought I had another house back here. I guess I was wrong. Well, maybe that's it. Place has potentials. Uh, I just want to show y'all, folks, 
a place that you can probably buy and own. A couple of things are still good, like this uh, this garage. That's still good, because you know why? Because you got a tin roof. I seen a hundred year old house with tin roof still standing today, because it has a tin roof. Look at that, tin roof, still standing today. The house, shingles. Oh, wait a minute, <laughs> wait a minute. It's a tin roof with holes in it. And it's, that house is pretty old. You've seen the door knobs and door handles. That was like in the 70s. Look how pretty that is, folks. Look at that scary tree. So, you got the bayou, you can do pea rowing, uh, make boats, plain land. This is a big ass property. I'm going to show you the, uh, the uh, saw when I get to the front. Somebody was shooting over here. Well, they were pretty close. So, good hunting ground. I mean, you can shoot out here because it got it's pretty far deep in the woods. Then you go on the other side of the bayou and definitely hunt some stuff. You can look on Google Map for this property. It's pretty big. I think this is what 20 or 42 acres of land this used to be all open field I think the person used to have own cows or something all this used to be open see there's another fireplace This barn is still good, except for the part that fell, where the tree fell, I think, on top of it. Um, this little building needs repair, but it, it's manageable. And I really don't know what else is on this property because the ground is all wet. Now I feel like getting my feet wet. But this place is pretty big. I'm gonna show you the sign. I'm gonna shut up. I told you that already. Damn you, boy! Well, I hope you enjoy. Look, you even got deer. What the hell is that? Okay, it's multiple deer. It looks like a big monster foot. Look at that. And we got dog or coyote. He be derg.
I guess people thought I was a hunter. <laughs> They thought, I remember I, uh, I had, I pulled over one place to make the video of one of the abandoned houses, safe house. And a woman thought I was hunting or something. You better not shoot around here to get. And, and I had a, a straight pole for my camera stand. And I guess she thought that was a gun. What was it? Look at that. Nice old iron gate up front. But well, somebody's been using this place as a hunting range because they got a trail here. And here's the sign for the place. And there's another sign over there we're going to take a look at. I'm gonna show you the nice iron gate. And here's the big iron gate. I'm Ranger Kiki. I hope you enjoy something that you can buy. The most of the places I showed you was all abandoned, but this place is for sale. So if you figured about getting a piece of property you can hunt on, do camping, or make something out of it, here it is. Here's the number again. Alright, I'm Ranger Kiki. I hope you enjoyed my video. Oh, 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 oh.